गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू मैथ्स क्लास एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज चैप्टर इलेवन लाइन्स एंड लाइन्स फर्स्ट वॉट इज लाइन द शॉर्टेस्ट डिस्टेंस बिटवीन टू पॉइंट इज लाइन नाउ नेक्स्ट नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न टाइप्स ऑफ lines okay so in class 2 you are going to learn four types of lines okay so here i am writing types of lines and how many lines total four lines you are going to read okay so number 1 this is what type of line can you tell me standing line this line we call standing line next number 2 this line is This line is sleeping line. Then number three, like this. This is slanting line. We call this one. slanting line that is little bit bent like this okay now number 4 i am going to write it here so number 4 is like this do you know this line name this one we call here i am writing curve what we call it we call it curve so again see from the first this one standing line like this number 2 sleeping line like this number 3 slanting line like this and number 4 curve line like this okay this one we call standing line this one is sleeping line this one is curve line and this one i said slanting line and slanting line can be like this also means little bit bent up like this or like this okay so standing line sleeping line curve line and like this will be slanting line okay so here i am going to write one alphabet and you tell me which line is this in that alphabet so if i write alphabet um k so i have written k here so this one is what like this so this is what type of line standing line so this line is what standing line now this line is looking like this na so this is what type of line slanting line and this one is also bent like this so are like this or like this both are slanting line i am not going to write it two times so if the line is like this then also slanting line and if the line is bent like this then also slanting line so this is 
standing line and these two are slanting line. Now, I am going to give you some question based on these lines. Okay? So now, can you see here, I have written two question. H, A, T, hat with the alphabet. Just now I have shown one example. So here also, with the capital alphabet, I have written H, A, T, hat. And now, you have to tell me how many standing lines are there, sleeping lines are there and slanting lines are there. This one line, two line. So, one, I am going to count it. So first, standing line has been asked. So, I will count the standing line. So, one, two and yes, this one also, three. So, how many standing lines are there? We are going to write it. 3. Okay? Now number 2 has been asked you sleeping lines. Okay? Sleeping lines means like this. So how many sleeping lines? 1, 2 and this one also 3. So how many sleeping lines? Yes, it is 3. Now slanting line means always like this, little bit bent or like this also. Okay? So, can you see? Yes. I can see two lines. One is this one. And number two. So, how many slanting lines are there? Two slanting lines. Now, come to number B. I have written digital number. Means in platform you have seen there is a big clock showing the digit like this. And in your home also and in shop also you can see that uh, some watches are there which is showing digitally. Okay. Now in this number, this one, can you identify? Yes, this is 8 and this one 9. So let us count first what is asked up. Standing line. So 1, 2, 3, 4. This is a small but this one is also a standing line. Either small or big. If it is a standing line we will count. Okay. So how many standing lines are there? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 standing line. So we will write here 4. Now next sleeping line. Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, how many sleeping lines? 5 sleeping lines. So, we will write here 5. Now, slanting line. Can you see any slanting line? Means little bit bent like this or like this. Yes, we have counted all the lines. No line is left. That means how many slanting lines? No lines. So, we are going to write it here 0. Zero slanting lines. Okay. Now let us see from the first. How many standing line we get? One, two, three. Three standing line. How many sleeping lines? One, two, three. Three sleeping lines. Slanting line. One, two. Two slanting lines. This one also. Standing line. One, two, three, four. Four. Sleeping lines, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 sleeping lines. And slanting line, no, no slanting line is there. So, we will write 0. Okay? Next, number C. What is this? Can you tell me? Yes, this is kite. And this kite, we are going to count the lines. Okay? So, First is standing line. Any standing line can you find? Mm, no. So standing line we are going to write 0. Now next sleeping line. How many sleeping line? Mm, only one. This one. So one sleeping line. Now curve. How many curve is there? Yes this one. Only one. This is. Okay. So curve 1. And now 
How slanting line? How many? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six slanting line. And next, this one. Can you tell me what is this? Mm, it is looking like a fish. Now, so let us count. Sleeping line. Any sleeping line is there? No. So, sleeping line, we are going to write zero. Next, slanting line. Yes, we can see the slanting line. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six slanting lines. So, we are going to write here six. Curve. How many curve is there? Yes, there are two curve. One, two. So, we are going to write two. Let us see from the first. This one, standing line. No. So, zero. Sleeping line. Only one. One. Curve line, we got only one. So, one. Slanting line. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Now, next figure. D. Sleeping line. No. So, zero. Slanting line. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six slanting lines. And curve. One, two. So, like this. Two. So, all the four questions you will write and practice in your maths copy. Okay? Now, it's a time to note down the homework. Write down all the classwork in your maths copy and try to do the answer by own self. So, that's all for today's class. Bye-bye.